Hey everybody, Ryan McCaffrey with IGN here. We're at Sledgehammer Games as part of IGN First Cover and Call of Duty Advanced Warfare all month long. I'm here with co-studio head, Glenn Schofield. Good to see you, sir. Hey, thanks for having me. So, uh, taking a, an exclusive look at a uh, newly revealed single-player level. Nobody's seen this yet. This is called Traffic, and uh, we're jumping in pretty well into it here, right? Yeah, yeah, we're near the, uh, the back third where uh, we're racing after the KVA, which is... Uh, a terrorist organization and uh, trying to get one of their one of the guys that they've kidnapped and um, so that, goes, that target truck uh, that it zoomed by and we missed it yes, so that's, that's, yes. that was hence the, uh, that's the, what we're the going quick after. profanity yes, <laughs> we're yeah, trying yeah. to now chase after it right. uh, like a couple badasses so um, we're, as we're rolling through here what are kind of the uh, how do you design a high-speed chase in a video game well, this one, this, we've been working on this level for uh, quite some time. It's probably one that was in development for over a year and a half and uh, trying to get some of this right. But, you know, Lagos is known for its traffic and its buses. And, yeah. and so we knew that we wanted to take advantage of some of that. And, um, and since we now have the EXO and the boost jump and mag gloves and things like that, you know, getting and jumping on top of these things and hanging off the sides of them um, made a lot more sense. Right. So... Um, yeah, this is one that, you know, you try and storyboard parts of it out and then uh, just keep experimenting to keep the action going. So, was the, uh, were earlier iterations of this longer, shorter? How does a, how does a level like this evolve over the course of development? Um, usually what happens is you, you've got this, the length of this section uh, out and what it, it, it becomes yeah. more, more dense with action as you yeah. keep going. Uh, we're like, oh, we can lay around this piece and a little bit more, and that's why it's just, you know, it's just like one thing after another after another. And, um, uh, but we try and give you just enough time that you know, you know what you're doing, and you can aim the gun and, um, and, and see, well, the, the action that's going on and, and all the detail that we put in the levels. Um, you know, the power of the new uh, platforms is pretty amazing because look how much we're able to uh, build and the detail yeah, we're able to get. There's a lot going on all at 60 frames here. Uh, yep. So now where where are we ultimately, how far into the game is this, I guess I should ask you. That's we're in the, uh, the, the first third of the game. This okay. is one of the, uh, um, you know, the first four Ooh. levels. Yeah, this is all, you know, we, we, uh, we love the stuff that's going on in Hollywood. <laughs> and um, I love we, this part. It's so good. Yeah, one of these, uh, I love what's about to come up. This was uh, another layer that's uh, about to happen. Just when you think you've got it all under control. Um, you don't no count on the corpse, don't. just, you know, this is dead foot slumps onto the accelerator pedal and bad things happen. <laughs> yeah. A lot of detail, yes. Um, and boom, that's not even the end of the level, right? No, well, no, there's there's a little bit more. Yeah, there's a, we didn't want to give too much away, but... Um, we figured we'd give you uh, some of the action of this one, and it's not even a, a big moment, as we call them. It. It's, yeah. uh, I okay. guess it's a big section. Well, that's a taste of uh, the traffic level of Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. We'll uh, see more when the game ships in November. Thanks, Glenn. Thank you.